So Sunday night I was going through footage for this week's video. I don't think it was good enough. So damn it, I'm gonna have to go fishing. It's Monday night after work, having a nice beer, waiting for my buddy to show up. We're gonna get after him. Here we go. Didn't take long, buddy. <laughs> <Better not. laughs> I mean, they, they went up right away. Just that's a nice looking gill. Look at that screen. Can you guys see all them fish? So, me and Dylan thought, what a better way after Monday after work to spend the night is uh, drink some beer and fish. That doesn't sound bad to me. So, before Dylan catches them all, we're going to... Jesus. Look at all them fish. Awesome. Nicer one. Little bastard. Catch pickle champ. There's a dozen fish down there. Easy. Oh, yeah. Well, should we flip the shack up and get the light on, get the heater on? Watch your head. There we go. <laughs> Already warmer. We're just down there waiting. Uh-huh. Strugging. I need to your line. Oh, okay. I was like, why is my line so slack? It is in my hand. That would make sense. Got him. All right. Now you done fucking my shit up on fish. Yep. <laughs> Sabotage. God dang it. Edit out all my misses. <laughs> Pull and drag. Decent bluegill. Yeah, it is. Just mob. Look at that. Three foot of freaking fish around it. Struck him. That's a nice bluegill. Jesus. He'd eat. Put him on 10 on hook, turn him into a 40 pounder. Is that on a waxy? Yeah. I got some of those spikes if you want to use those. Did pretty good. I don't think we it really matters what. Yeah, I might that's probably true. I'm probably gonna throw on a plastic here pretty soon. Then you don't have to keep baiting up. Done pretty well on those plastics this year. Yeah, I mean, especially in frenzies like this, they'll just hammer them, and uh, you don't have to rebate every time. White and red are usually my go-to's, but gold worked awesome one day. They were hitting gold left and right. They did pretty good with the red one the other day. It's like those people at Jurassic Plastics know what they're doing. Oh, it quit falling. I think I got one on. <laughs> <laughs> Fell about four foot and stopped. Drag peelers. Oh, lost them. Oh, you suck. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to edit out all the ones I miss. Yeah, I'm going to leave yours in. Yeah. <laughs> this guy sucks. <laughs> Dylan only caught two fish and missed 12. <laughs> I can't even see where my jig's at on uh, the screen. <laughs> smaller class. You need to get bigger. Or at least let me get past you to get down to the bigger ones. I want to see what's down at the bottom, but I can't get there. Mm -mm. They come up and meet it. Oh, bigger bluegill. That's a nice one. Yeah. Make a nice fish fry if we're cleaning fish. So you got to get down past these guys, and then you get to the bigger ones. But that's a little tougher done than said. Because they're like a swarm. It doesn't fall fast enough to get away from them. 
<laughs> oh, you fooled me. They're on to my game. Now they're waiting for me on the bottom. All right. Bigger lure. Switching plastics. Let's get some bigger fish. Can't have Dylan catch a bigger fish than me. Try the old creature bait on a Swedish pimple. There he is. What'd we come up with? Oh, that's a big <laughs> I think that's a keeper, buddy. Oh, I'd say Look so. at him swallow that creature bait. Gone. And I don't have to rebate. I guess I gotta get this one out of his throat, but <laughs> fish on. Another good one. He don't feel large. Class smaller. I'm choking this bait though. He don't want to go home. He didn't. Oh, he's gone. Got him that time. Oh, that's a nice run. Oh, yeah. Definitely clean that one. Look how far down they're choking these baits. That plastic is just gone. That's why when I miss one, I'm like, how? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone I catch it's in his damn throat. Ah, oh, dang it. Damn electrician, get the light on. <laughs> These headlands are bright. Yeah, and I, I'm not sure how long they last because I haven't had them out enough, but they sure are bright. And they got a blue light and a red light. Mm -hmm. Now we got our lights back on. We just got a whole lot of lights going on love rechargeable headlamps mm -hmm. especially for flathead fishing and ice fishing you, i always buy two and then you leave one plugged in your truck at all time you got one in your tackle box that's smart so you always got one charged up i need a beer i know that and i think i've gotten a beer out so there's probably an unopened beer somewhere i just haven't had time to drink it that's a problem for when we run out <laughs> it'd be like an easter egg huh? <laughs> remember that beer you, you sat out <laughs> Found it. That heater's plenty warm. Oh yeah, even with a hole in there. After I catch this, ooh, he might be a decent one. Uh, not quite. He's the he's the year below graduating class. Bluegill Slayers. What old fish do we have in here, Dill? Uh, I've heard there's northern walleye, catfish. Bass, bluegill, and some crappie. Looks just like bass and bluegill for right now. <laughs> we got them dialed in. <laughs> that might be dink of the day. There, fish on. Not a nice gill. Stalking me. There he is. That's why they didn't like the big minnow. There's the group of misfits we'll be spending the day with. We're gonna hit the ice again. Try to remake that video that got messed up with my buddy Brian and his uncle Bug. Also gonna have a guest appearance by Elden. Sounds like they've been struggling. So I'm gonna show up. Hopefully show them how to catch fish. Nothing to make me feel better than them struggling all morning. I show up and the fish start turning on. It'd just be a coincidence, but we're not we're not gonna let them know that. Dave's baited choice. Pinhead minnows. A little drastic plastic. There's one. What's he doing over there? Nice little crabby. Mine's bigger. Yours is not. Well in the meantime, I'm gonna enjoy this nice tall one. Hard bait. 
used to be titties and beer, now it's fishing and beer. I'd say fishing and beer trumps titties and beer any day. There, fish on. Eating not big one. Let's fish on. It's kind of a trend around here. Right yeah. Loving the drastic plastic. He choked it. I had a whisker seeker dinner last night. We stayed at a hotel. What's that? Uh, that's that catfish company that sponsors me. Oh, okay. So we had our like Christmas party type deal. Talked about. What's that? I was at Prairie Meadows last night for my Christmas party. Oh, really? Yeah. Where were you at? Uh, Irina's Steakhouse. Oh, yeah. I didn't see you. Yeah. Where's that at? Uh, Jordan Creek, yeah. It was good. Okay. And there's so much new stuff coming out on Whisker Seeker okay. this year. Is there? Yeah, it's this spring's gonna be amazing. See how the team fishing's going. Buddy's got a pile. You're catching them where there's no fish. <laughs> He's a magician. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Would you catch that fish already? He got stage fright. There he comes. Oh. There he is. Oh. oh, it's a monster. Look oh, at the size Jesus. of that fish. <laughs> got anything on your screen, Eldon? Oh, you're double pulling. Yeah. That's what happens. You get greedy with two poles, you don't catch that. That's right. Every time I try to use two poles, I miss more than I catch. I'm just not coordinated enough. What was the word? Coordinated. <laughs> <laughs> From down south. Yeah. Well, that's a Murphy's Law thing. <laughs> Gets it, yeah. 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 Every time. Yeah, pretty much every time. I don't know. I think I had the bluegills move in here just a minute ago. Yeah. Those bastards. <laughs> Ruin all your crappy fud. Yeah. Yeah. But they're still around. Yeah. They got my. Uh, Little plastic thing tore up the bass. Oh, that one liked it. There we go. Yes. That's a nice little crappie. Eating the old plastics? Doubled up. Doubled up. Well, you got baby size bird bugs. <laughs> <laughs> I like the dumb ones that just swallow it like that guy. <laughs> Got a bluegill. Sign of a good fishing partner. Brings the boost lattes. Thank you, sir. Still slamming down here, buggy? Oh, yeah. I'm about 15 or 16 now. It's just not fair, is it? No, it ain't fair. You sick bug on them and it's just not even fair. Ryan's over here one hand on the, on the damn phone just catching fish. You got Eldon joining the group. You got fish down there, buddy? None. There is now. Yeah, I was going to say, usually if you jig them, they'll come right in. Oh, yeah. Fish on! It's easy as that. Monster crappie. <laughs> B boys over here in the nursery. B boys on the board. He got me. <laughs> Might be losing the war, but you won that battle. Stacking them up. Yes, sir. Ray's uh, oh, yeah. showing the world how it's done. I'm a rookie. Oh. Here we go. Here we go. On cue. On cue. You say it, I catch it. Come here. There he is. That's an adder. Yeah. 
I got a question for the professor. What's up, buddy? Okay. How come when you pull them out of the ice, they look like this, real fucking shiny, right? But then after they sit on the ice, they turn real dark. They freeze. They're skin pigments. Is that what happens? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Guess that should have been smarter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's green, right? They're thick down there. Well, they knew Bug was in town. They knew they were going to get caught, so they might as well just give up. <laughs> they just swim right the hole. So That's it. right. Yeah. Here I am, yeah. waving the white flag. Oh, they're chasing. Got him. This don't feel like a very big one, though. I had a real nice one. Oh, shit. Oh, bluegill. Oh, That's, bluegill. Nice blue That's nice bluegill. Yeah. We know how Brian loves clean bluegill. Yeah. <laughs> Hell, Brian's back on the board. I can't even keep up with him. Screamed up to me. I had a bite. Do I catch? Yeah, that's what I got. <laughs> fish everywhere. <laughs> there, fish. It's a nice little bluegill. He might even be too big to cut up for cut bait. Nice hand sized bluegill. We'll see if we can't find a smaller one for catfish bait. Got him. Another nice bluegill. Maybe a little bigger than the last one. Not a bad little bluegill. Too big to cut up. Get him back. So the first one was on my little orange teardrop. This one is a gunmetal green and silver Swedish pimple. That's probably the 12th lure I've tried so far and only two little fish. So we're going to keep after them. If I find something they're going to consistently bite on, I'll uh, start hole hopping. But until then, I'm just having fish come in. They uh, play around for a little bit. No bites and they're gone. So... Hopefully this lure change is going to help us out. Hopefully we find something that works. Stop above them. Jig, jig, jig. Nothing. They're retreating. I'm going to go below them. There's fish on. Around the transducer. What we got here? Nice bend to the pole. Pulling a little drag. Ditch pick off. The old gun metal and silver again. Bass lure for the monsters. Let's see if we can go down there. There's a couple more down there. Get him back in the water. Get back after them. Top above them. Give a few jigs. Screaming up. Fish. Uh, bluegill. That's a nice bluegill. Nice little bluegill. That's going to be it for this week. Thank everybody for joining me on the ice. If you're still watching, please like and subscribe. We'll see you next week with a new podcast.